Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Jack Frost nipping at your nose. Although it's been said many times, many ways, Merry Christmas to you. On the eighth day of luck, Miss My True Love came to me. A partridge in a pantry. Hey guys, look, look at me. I want to give a shout out to my sis, K Cooks, LK Reality TV. She put me on to these little glasses right here. I got me a little reindeer pair too. I just thought they were so cute. And I like to wear like Santa's hat or you know a headband or something to indicate that the holidays are here so i said why not start now i know i look silly but i just thought they were cute honey i just like to do little stuff like that guess what day it is it is day eight of vlogmas let me tell y'all something first of all i'm running behind and I'm talking to y'all, but what can I say? Let me tell y'all something. How about I am enjoying doing the vlogmas, you know, like the daily vlogs and stuff. I enjoy it. And I feel like, <laughs> I feel like I'm in a class and that I gotta beat the deadline. I gotta get my assignment done and beat the deadline. That's how I'm feeling. I'm enjoying it, you know. So today, guys, I am taking you with me to work, you know. Um, I, it ain't no telling what else we're going to do. So I guess you just got to wait and see. Whew, we are midday. Y'all, I'm tired. It's 1.43. I'm about to go get me some lunch. I don't know what I want, though. You know, you just really need. I ain't had no breakfast. So y'all know I'm really struggling a little bit. Stomach growling. Your girl is weight. Let's see. Um But yeah, so I don't know if I told y'all, but you know, my husband and I, we decided. Let's see. So my husband and I, we decided that we're not going to um, put a tree up this year. And I'm actually okay with it because I started to feel a little bit overwhelmed. Not really overwhelmed, but I just was like, dang, you know, I got to get the tree. I got to do this. I got to do that. But um, the good thing about it is. We won't be doing one this year, so I found the cutest two little elves, y'all. They are so cute. You, I got them from Dollar Tree, and one is light skin, which my husband is light skin, and then one is dark skin. She got the little skirt on. She got two little afro puffs. So cute. So I'm gonna show y'all those when I get home. And I said, you know, my little mantle is already cute, and so I just put us up on the mantle. <laughs> I just set us up on the little mantle and my husband he put out a uh, Mr. and Mrs. Claus so they just chilling so I have to uh, show y'all um, the his and her elves when I seen them y'all they reminded me so much of my husband and I so guess what I had to I couldn't leave them there for a dollar twenty five I showed Mr. Dollar Days like why is it a dollar twenty five you know but anyway it's all good so far today is amazing I mean it was amazing when it started honey when I opened those eyes up it was amazing I just thank God you know for being faithful in who he is in my life I'm trying to get my husband to do some Philly cheesesteak egg rolls 
y'all he got it down packed so i wonder if i ask him will he allow me to um video him not necessarily his face because he was like i ain't trying to be on the camera you know but i'm gonna see he might enjoy it he might be like hey when, when we cooking on youtube again <laughs> but yeah so yep i got i think i have like three more people left and then i'll be finished so i have a nice little um lunch break i have a client under the dryer but she has like a she has to dry for an hour and 30 minutes so i'm going to go grab me some lunch i'm going to eat my lunch i don't know what i want i want something different though i always get the same exact thing like i want one of them good old hood plates you know they got all that all that good stuff on it honey some good old side orders when your stuff just be feeling over in the in the plate touching stuff hmm I don't know where to go. I don't know. I don't want beans, boys. I don't want. Let's see. What do I want? Oh. Some Mexican sounds good. But yeah. So I do not. I don't have to um, put a tree up. I did buy some stuff from Dollar Tree. Look at this little Christmas tree. I bought this stuff yesterday, but I think I'm gonna take it back. I think I'm gonna take it back because it's just like I'm just really just thinking overthinking and just but this is the cutest look. I think I'm gonna keep this. It was only a dollar twenty-five. Put that on my station. Look at that, y'all. Ain't that cute? It's glowing and shimmering. I don't wanna oh I can go get me a, a sandwich. But do I want one from Jimmy John's or do I want one from Jersey? I want some food where I have to use a fork. But yeah, that's neither here nor there. I don't want wings. Lord, Father, where are you guiding my wheels? Holy Spirit, I need your help. I need your help. If you're into, you know, into the YouTube thing, Y'all leave some comments down at the bottom, like share with me, like um, if it's certain videos that you guys would like for me to do, like all I, all I can do is say, yeah, I got you. Or be like, nah, I ain't gonna fool with that. You know what I'm saying? Okay guys, so that is Mrs. Claus. That is Mr. Claus. And look, guys, that's us. <laughs> Ain't that so cute, guys? She chocked it like me and caramel like my husband. I thought we were cute. Look at that. We look so cute. Y'all, that's all the decorations we got. That's it, baby. That's it. I love a cast iron skillet. I want to do this whole bag of shrimp. Like seriously, am I the only person that disrespect paper towels? Like when I tell y'all that I go through paper towels like it ain't nothing. So the name, I'm trying to see, C, C pack. That's the name of the actual um, shrimp scampi. It already have the seasonings, the coatings, and everything. Normally, I do fresh shrimp, but tonight, you know, tonight we're doing something different. Tonight, we're just going to make it easy, okay? So, while my shrimp are cooking in this pan, let's see, let me cut my stove on. So, in this pan here, I'm going to do my cabbage so I'm gonna let that heat up a bit while it's heating up and getting nice and you know I'm trying to think should I do more sausage let me get my EVOO 
So I'm gonna pour some of that in my pan. And I ain't scared to pour it in there, okay? I like to hear that sizzle. It smells good in here already, girl. I may do half of this and do the other half another time because it goes such a long way, you know? Dependable, dependable God. No matter what comes my way. So look at all my little stuff, y'all. My little, my little um, ingredients. They're looking so delicious. Well, holy and acceptable. Cut that core out of there. I was thinking there might still be some good cabbage on here. I don't think so. Okay. Yep. So. Those of you who have been with me for a little bit, y'all know I like my cabbage thin. We like our cabbage thin in the Mason household. So I just literally slice it really thin, my guys. And see, I like my cabbage to have some crunch to it still after I cook it. My husband, he prefer his cabbage to be a little softer. So I kind of get it in between to where we are both satisfied, you know? So while I am cutting my cabbage up, I'm gonna put my onion. My peppers. I use so many different colored peppers simply because I just like the color. Just let those kind of simmer in. Yes.
just like that guys dinner is done all right until tomorrow <laughs> bye